Yokogawa RT Virtualization System Demonstration. We will demonstrate two virtualization technology and functions, live migration and automatic failover of Yokogawa Virtualization Platform for Process Control System to improve availability and shorten the system downtime. This is our demonstration environment. Yokogawa offers multiple virtualization system configurations. Our demonstration environment is the high availability cluster configuration called HA Cluster System. We have two virtualization servers and one shared storage in the server rack to reduce the impact of hardware failure on plant operation. We use thin clients as the HMI function of the virtual machine. Thin clients and virtualization servers are connected through remote UI network switches. Now, let's get started. The first one is Live Migration. What is Live Migration? Live Migration is used for planned hardware maintenance. Live Migration moves running virtual machines to another virtualization server without stopping operation and monitoring. In this demonstration, HIS-0154 Virtual Machine is running on Server 1 and HIS-0153 Virtual Machine is running on Server 2. When Server 2 requires hardware maintenance, HIS-0153 can be moved to Server 1 by live migration. Live migration will take only a few seconds. Plant operators may not notice the live migration. With live migration, hardware maintenance can be done without affecting the plant operation. Now we will demonstrate live migration. This is the management screen of virtualization environment. It shows that two HISs are running on the virtualization servers. HIS-0154 is running on HVS-0001 Server 1, and HIS-0153 is running on HVS-0002 Server 2. We will move HIS-0153 from HVS-0002 to HVS-0001 using live migration function. Select HIS-0153, right-click, and select Move, Live Migration, select Node, and choose HVS-0001 as a destination server, then click OK. That's it! Finished! Very simple! Now let's take a look at HIS-0153 HMI screen. You see that there is no data loss or special alarms on the HMI window. Live migration does not affect the plant operation. Next is automatic failover. What is automatic failover? Automatic failover is used for hardware trouble recovery. Automatic failover restarts a virtual machine automatically in another virtualization server when a virtualization server stops by failure or disaster. In this demonstration, HIS-0154 is running on Server 1 and HIS-0153 is running on Server 2. HIS-0153 and HIS-0154 virtual machine images are stored in the shared storage. If something happens to Server 2 and Server 2 stops, HIS-0153 virtual machine will be stopped and restarted on Server 1 automatically using the HIS-0153 image on the shared storage. Automatic failover takes about several minutes, whereas it takes about one day to recover from hardware in the conventional physical environment. Automatic failover reduces the system downtime in case of a failure or disaster. Now we will demonstrate automatic failover. We are at the back side of the server rack. We will disconnect a network cable from server 2 to imitate the system failure. Let's check HIS-0153 HMI screen. You see that it gets dark now. You find the error pop-up message. Operators can recognize the trouble by the error message. The next step for the operator is to contact a system administrator to check HIS-0153 status. Now, let's take a look at the management screen of virtualization environment. HIS-0153 status is now unmonitored on HVS-0002 Server 2 as the server is failed. 
As automatic failover is performed, HIS-0153 status is changed as running on HVS-0001 Server 1. Now operators can connect to HIS-0153 from Thin Client. We will connect to HIS-0153. We could connect to HIS-0153. Now we are back in the operation. Let's check the trend view. You see that the data was lost for only about five minutes while automatic failover was performed. On the other hand, trend view in HIS-0154 has no data loss and the operator can continue operation and monitoring without interruption on HIS-0154. Automatic failover minimizes the impact of sudden failure to the plant operation. With these virtualization technologies, customers' system availability can be significantly improved. Yokogawa Virtualization Platform